A dying colonialism is at once a philosophical, political and polemical deliberation into the state and meaning of Algerian war of independence from France. The book was published in France in 1959. The book has five parts, each highlighting a specific group or phenomenon related to the Algerian revolution. women radio the family medicine and europeans fanon employs psychopathological reflection revolutionary rhetoric and satire in philosophy to deliberate with these five groups the chapter on radio explains how radio alger made clear to the algerians that french power could be challenged algerians develop an affinity for the radio and by the time revolution picked up its heat every home had a radio Radio which was a tool of colonial expression became a unifying force in the Algerian revolution in the essay Algeria unveiled Fanon discusses how the removal of veil allowed Algerian women to challenge the colonizers abandoning old cultural norms new meaning was attributed even if it was to come back the revolution challenged the way Algerians thought about families traditional patriarchal family structure crumbled when brothers sisters and married couple were thrown into military in the chapter on medicine fanon argues that even colonial medicine which was thought to be beneficial to humanity has to be perceived as part of colonial oppression fanon also touches upon how people from other races joined in the fight for independence in a racially heterogeneous algeria unity through culture is a major theme of the book while the colonizers attack culture through segregation and subjugation the colonized configured a cultural unity to fight against the colonial oppression the book also explains how revolution transformed the individual consciousness of people in their fight for independence fanon rather than emphasizing on the struggle and suffering of the algerian people points to the courage and confidence of the algerians in fighting an opposition way bigger than its strength